morning, good afternoon, good evening, and welcome to Yoma's Day 7. It is officially Wednesday. It's another, it's, it's a glorious day here today, but it's another chilly one. We, it's to get even colder, so. I am super wrapped up today. I'm only really feeling it on my fingers, so that's where I mostly feel the cold these days. Um, I don't. I can't really type with like gloves on, uh, so my fingers normally suffer the most during the day. Haven't recorded up till now, really, really struggled to get out of bed this morning. I just wanted to hibernate, like I knew it was going to be a cold one. I also really didn't sleep very well last night, and it was only between probably say like quarter past six and nine that I actually got some sleep. So that sucked. <laughs> And, um, yeah, it's just, it's been one of those days where, like, in work I feel like I'm just putting out fire after fire. Like, not a literal fire. Like, just one problem after another after another. And I constantly have to be that person that goes to other people to be like, have you done this yet? Have you looked into this yet? Can you please give me the information I requested a month ago? Like, there's one thing where I sent an email on the 27th of September. And it's quite a big thing and I sent it to like three managers not one of them got back to me and I'm just like and you have the nerve to turn around and blame me for not doing something I'm like I sent it to you to deal with <sighs> but you know what my team manager has seen that I'm trying to be proactive about it and that's the main thing so nobody can turn around and say that I didn't do anything so yeah, it just feels like one of those days where it's like one issue after another and you're constantly like putting out metaphorical fires and trying to calm everything down and then the next thing creeps up and then the next one and then the next one. And it's like just as you deal with one problem or you try not, like you pass it on to the people that need to give you the next bit, like that's when the next problem creeps in. I hope they're giving room for whatever emergency service. Oh, fire brigade. It's like such a busy main road, but it's not that wide a, wide a road. Uh, okay, so. I'm on my lunch break just now. It's like 3 o'clock I'm on my lunch break. Ooh, clear. Won't be eating that one. That can... That's probably going to go in the bin, to be honest. I don't do toffee. Too many times I've ate a toffee and my filling has just been pulled right out. Right, that's the chocolate one done. Uh, day 7, front and centre. Not very hard to find today. Always good. Oh, that's a nice colour. It's like... I want to say like a mint, but it's not. I'm not really sure how it's on my screen, and it always comes up uh, comes up differently on the screen of the camera onto my laptop. It's coming up very like sky blue. It's not. There's definitely a hint of or like an undertone of green or yellow. I am so bad at describing colors. Uh, but it's a really, really gorgeous colour. That's really, really pretty. Oh, I got you on. Ooh, excuse me. So yeah, I think today is going to be a very slow day. It's going to be a very non-interactive day. What's going on with my cheek? Why am I really red? Um... Yeah, it's just going to be one of those days I literally need to run upstairs and pack my bag for my overnighter, make sure everything is, like I have everything, uh, like silly stuff like my chargers, uh, my eye mask because I sleep with an eye mask, uh, I need to pull out fresh pyjamas, um, I need to pack my Christmas jumper because it's Christmas jumper day tomorrow in work. I also think I'm going to take this, just be a wee bit extra. 
and then my earrings. I don't think I'll take my antlers, uh, but I'm certainly going to take this and just be a wee bit extra. <laughs> I had to pack my advent present, uh, no, it's not, not advent present, my secret Santa present. Uh, we were all going to, not everybody had to do it and they asked like, do you want to take part, do you not want to take part? And they were only asking like that you buy something like a fiver. So I bought something last night in Asda and what I've found with Secret Santa over the year is that, well that's never good when a second fire engine goes down. I hope it's not serious. Uh, yeah, so what I've found with Secret Santas is it quite, people tend to quite, oh my god, what did I just say? People tend to buy quite feminine aimed products and there's not normally anything for the guys in the team and I'm talking like bubble bath I'm not saying guys can't take bubble bath certainly not Scott would love a bubble bath if we had a bath um, but they tend to be quite feminine products and I saw something that was for men and I picked that up uh, so at least if there's like an overwhelming amount of feminine products that they're just like, ah, oh, thanks. Then someone might give them a swap to be like, hey, I actually want the feminine product. Do you want this one? And obviously that is under the impression that there is that whole feminine masculine of a product. I'm just, from my experience where I work, people buy what is typically sold to women in a feminine fashion. I'm just digging a bigger hole. We all know I don't really believe in the constraints of gender considering I'm non-binary. But yeah, uh, I need to wrap that. I need to pack my bag. Once I'm finished work I need to <laughs> deconstruct my work setup. Even though I've been told you shouldn't need to bring your laptop in, I'm gonna bring my laptop in because knowing my luck I'll need it. Uh, and then I need to pack up my keyboard and my mouse because I have specialist equipment. I then need to remember my work fob so that I can actually get in the door. And I also need to remember another piece of equipment that I need to do my job. So it's not a light journey for me. This is why I don't particularly like going down into the office because for other people it's just you rock up in the office. For me, I have to bring laptop, keyboard, mouse and my when I say fob I don't mean my work fob now I did a second ago but there's a fob I need to log on to a website I need to do my work so it's not straightforward for me and it's like breaking that all down and then taking it to work and putting it all together and then breaking it down again to bring it home to put it all back together it's it's a lot I don't particularly enjoy going into the office for that particular reason and given the time of year, I also don't particularly like driving at night because of my astigmatism in my eye. And if you know what I mean by that, I mean all the lights. Everything sparkles and like stars out instead of just being a light. Um, so yeah, I'm going to get off my butt. I'm going to go pack my bag, wrap up my secret Santa. And uh, hopefully I will heat my hands up a wee bit because... It's just how cold my hands are, like, my toes and my hands, that's what's cold. <sighs> but yeah, not sure if there's going to be much more in the way of footage for today, just given the fact I'm going to be a bit rushed, and then I'm going to be driving in the dark. But if I can, I'll insert some footage of the cats, uh, Monty and Eli, and a... Uh, yeah, tomorrow is going to be interesting. We'll see how that goes. So, thanks for watching.
Thank you.